Clearly, it is graduation season and wedding season is coming up right behind. Of course. So how do you know if you're giving the appropriate gift? New this morning, John Shumway is here with a gift 411. Tell us what we need to know, John. Yeah, nobody wants to offend the gift receiver, and a lot of it depends on your relationship to the person or, in the wedding case, to the couple. And very importantly, it also depends on whether you plan to attend the event. In the mailbox, they come, the invitations. First rule, and listen closely to this. You are not obligated to send a gift if you're not attending. National lifestyle blogger and Uniontown native Amanda Mushro. That has been long standing. You can send a note saying, I can't wait to see the pictures and the videos from your special day, congratulations. But you are not obligated to send a gift if you're not attending the event. What is a reasonable graduation gift for a kid graduating from high school? There's a pretty wide range that is seems to be the average, and it can go anywhere from $70 up to $200. If it's a college graduation, anywhere between $100 to $500. Gift cards are okay, but Mushro says they should be personalized. And I like it when it's something specific that you know that the person could really use. Or she says a personalized basket of goodies for the college bound graduate that reflects their needs of where they're heading. Yeah, in fact, she gave the example of herself. She was headed to WVU and someone gave her a basket of things college kids need, plus some WVU things in the basket. She loved it. No one wants to be the cheapskate. So when in doubt, consult others who you know have been invited about what they're going to give as well. Yeah, that's a great idea. And you said it depends on your relationship with that person. So what do you mean? Just how close you are in general, whether you like them at all? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something like that. I don't know about the like part. But Bushro says if it's someone that you're really not close yeah. to, in fact, you had to think long and hard about who the heck is this, you can go to the lower end of the scale. But if it's someone close to you, you might want to go to the higher end of the scale.